Penguins with glasses and a bow tie should move nine steps. Other penguins should move 14 steps. Have you noticed how important instructions are um, in this part of the course? Because they're giving us very specific code to write. All right, move the penguins that have both glasses and a bow tie nine steps. So for pee and penguins, okay. Yeah, we don't want any of those say. So we're just gonna get rid of those. Actually, I think they have the spacing there to help us because we're gonna use an if else. Um, well, let's see. As in, if the penguin has glasses and a bow tie, take nine steps, else or otherwise take 14. If P has bow tie, and P has glasses. I many times forget my second P or my second letter, um, and I just wanna do and has glasses. I don't know if that happens to you, but it's, it's good to catch those things because then you know what to look for when your code doesn't work. Then that penguin will step nine. Else, meaning for everything else, P, step 14. The beauty of an if else condition is we don't have to define any other parameters. It's just all the other ones will do that. And then we're gonna go to the banana. All right, that should get us there.